Hello guys, we're right here, and I just wanted to tell you that I got a pretty decent battle with Hit em up. Most of you that are actually watching this shit and are on the channel will know that Yeah, Hit em up is a very good YouTuber. He's really good. He was actually one of the main He actually inspired me of starting YouTube So yeah and this video was a pretty close, intense, and you battle, and I suck at and you. I don't even know. And and you, I'm horrible. So yeah, you know what? Let's stop that blah blah thing and let's go right into the mat. Sorry because I'm not gonna remember most of the things. I predicted the senselessly to my surprise and went to for alligator. I went straight for the waterfall. I was like derp, derpity, derp, derp. And yeah, he goes to go go. Like, come on, that was super obvious, George. Put your brain to work, but you know, I don't, but I don't really mind about it that much. Oh yeah, let's go to normal, this is too slow. So yeah, I bred 0 out of 6. I have a really good wall to wheezing, like, I don't even do if you do max bulk up. That you won because I have sludge bomb. Here I do a very good play, I didn't want for sludge bomb, it was a bit too obvious. So I go for will-o-wisp, and guess what we burn? The sand slash, and that's pretty good. Hopefully he doesn't have any heal bell, but he actually does. I go to her alligator. He throws his stealth rocks that I don't really mind. I don't have focus as people. Maybe it's just breaking probable past 30. But you know, we're just going for it. Waterfall does a pretty uh, good amount. Then he sadly, he sadly has heal bell in his Pokemon. Actually here he goes for body slam, sorry. Probably just eats it up like it's nothing because no, obviously. Now I get my opportunity to set up rocks, and that's pretty useful for the pyro. Because you will see, rocks will help me a bunch with that thing. Now I go back to Feraligir predicting the pyro. Again, nice kills, man. <laughs> um, I tried there, you know. Thanks God that I didn't go to a paralyze. Then I go to Miss Maze. I'm like, okay, he's not gonna do anything to me. He goes for Toxic, and I know I can set up all over th this thing. And guess what? I'm like, okay, Miss Maze, you sweep, we can do it. But no, 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 I got it so, so wrong. This is a scrappy milk tank. When I saw that, I was like, what the fuck? What the fuck hit him up? You're hacking or what? Then I go for the Thunderbolt, bolt, and I'm like, my gosh, dude. That is definitely not a common set. And I'm like scrappy, I'm literally soft. Then I'm like clang clang. I get the opportunity to set up a gear ground because you can't touch me. You can't talk, you can't do shit on me. We go for shit gear, I'm like come on, clink clink sweep. And yeah, I'm like okay, come on, YOLO. I go for gear grind, I get a crit, and guess what? Crit. And then a normal one, or not enough. He goes for earthquake, but clink clang. It's clutch. I kill it, but guess what? I I die too. So it was a double knockout. The match seems pretty bad for me, but you know I still have some good pulse. And guess what? I got okay. I, I stopped it for a bit. So yeah, gramble. Wow. Go to wheezing. It can completely wall it. He goes for player off. Wheezing doesn't even feel it. My God. Hear him like no. Willow wisp is too obvious. So I'm gonna go for sludge bomb. And guess what we get on? the pyro and we get the poison too so that's even better you know we don't actually have to do then I'm like for alligator or probo pass I go to probo pass it's like I predicted the probo pass and guess what if I would run to for alligator I could it would have burned me and that would make for alligator literally useless here is where I'm like okay you can survive another one and I can just go for vault switch to go maybe on wheezing because he seems the most important dude, now that he lost his Pyro, especially in his Sand Slash. Sand Slash actually couldn't do anything. And his team has a very big... It gets crippled, now he goes for a milk drink. I'm like, fuck, we're gonna start that PvP stall. And, and hit him up, trust me, he can play that game all day and night. He has a milk tank. He doesn't even need to be worried. Maybe a, crud, a crit poison sludge bomb would help, but no. Then I do a nice prediction here, I predict the milk drink and I go to SHOCK Because SHOCK is the ultimate boss This thing used to be choice banner but now it's scarf And it got really useful actually Because it has a bit of a weakness to SHOCK, you know 
three Pokemon and only one resistance. That is Gramble. But you see, I slowly weaken this Gramble, and that's what I want. So then, can shock can just spam close combat. Then I sack off my Probo Pass. He goes for Payback. I'm like, what the fuck? Gramble can learn Payback? I was completely shocked over there. But then I'm like, okay, go easy. Let's just go for a Willow. Willow Wish, I think. Nope, Sludge Bomb. Okay. I don't get a poison, which would be really helpful. Now, I don't know if he's gonna go for Metal Drain. No, he doesn't. So I go for Body Slam. So yeah, we get them Willow Wisps off, and I'm like, oh yeah, that's right. So, yeah, now we're gonna start that thing again. I need to force him to go for a middle train. I think in the next slot bomb. He's trying to weaken my thing. This means he's troubling for my team, I know. I know, through that. Now he goes for Heal Bell. And guess what? Weezing is like, -la 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 -la. and I know. It's pretty a lull moment. Now I'm gonna do. I No, I didn't. What? Why I didn't did it? You stupid myself. Why you didn't do that? Anyways, now I'm gonna do it, I think, on Shock. Nope, I, 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 keep, I keep on staying. And I missed a Fire Blast. Wow, why would have went for Fire Blast? There was no way he's gonna go to go go Oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. He goes for Heal Bell, and I'm like, wow, good job, Weezing. Good job, myself. But I get the poison, so I'm like, la la la. Yeah, that was. I think it was kind of hacks on my side. I'm PB stalling you. That is not. He has been almost too full, I know. Now he has to go for Metal Green, and I'm like, yes, Sock can find his time to sign. And I'm like, sad, close combat, this Metal Green is done. So yeah, Metal Green is dead. Now he goes to Gramble, he's like, gonna intimidate my Sock. How the fuck can you intimidate Sock? I don't even know, but he somehow does. Yeah, because he's hungry. Gramble. He goes for a player off, he misses, like, you know, that literally matters. You know, that thing would have done so much damage. I missed a Willow Wisp. And he goes for a payback. That's actually pretty scary. Don't do that. I go for Sludge Bomb, I kill it. I'm like, wow, dude, I'm not playing around with you. It's like, no worries, man. Because, yeah, that miss would didn't matter. And here I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna go for Self Go for Willow Wisp. And if I could miss that Willow Wisp, it would have been a GG already. I'm just saying. But Weezing is a clutch and he hits it. I was like, I was literally like on my, on my, on my, yeah, you know what I mean. He goes for Razor Soul, I go for Pain Split. I don't even know why I went for that. I didn't want to waste another Sludge Bomb, maybe for the, he goes for another Cell Smash. And that is where I'm like, oh my gosh, this can be a bit dangerous. But you know, Weezing can handle that crap. He goes for Sludge Bomb, my god. If this thing had recover to like Roos or something, Razor Cell, Weezing eats it up and kills that Barbarical. Yeah, he would. That would have been GG exactly. If you would, if I would have missed, because he would kill me. Then he goes for Rock Slime. He hits it. I'm like, no, no flinch. Even though it, I go for Sludge Bomb. I freaking that Gogo is like fuck. Then he says, yeah, I'm fucked now. He missed the Rock Slide. I don't think that still mattered because I had a choice scarf sock and a for alligator. My MVP. Okay, so let's see. GG. Source for the Michigan. Good battle. Don't thought. I had you for a bit. Don't be man. That wheezing destroyed me. But wheezing was so important. Maybe should have saved Pyro for it. And actually, the most crucial plate was the one that I predicted the Pyro didn't want to reveal with. Because. I did it once, I said let's change it, maybe, and I hit it and I poisoned it too, that helped the bonds. So, you know, it gets to the range where it walls with skills. Mine is raising, yep, obviously, definitely. So yeah, I think that's gonna be the end of the episode, guys. That was a really good battle, even though I, I'm sure hit em up would have crossed me in any other time, but there I got lucky. I hope you enjoyed the video and tell me who is the MVP. What? That's not even a question. It's definitely wheezing. Um, MVP from Van um, Vanilla Call. Hit em up, Steam. I don't know. Maybe. Barbarical could. Was actually the biggest threat in Pyro. Anyways, this is gonna be the end of the episode. Hope you enjoy. And make sure to tell me which Pokemon can go to end you to are you. I would say wheezing and maybe shock.
because they're all so deadly. So yeah, thank you for watching and make sure to sub and like if you want to. I'm like, I'm not forcing you. I'm doing these videos for my fun. So yeah, guys, bye.